today we are going to be doing a total body workout. We'll have a little bit of cardio in there. We'll definitely have core, upper and lower body. You are going to need one kettlebell or one weight, whatever you have available to you right now. We're going to actually move right into our first round of exercises. We're going to use that as our warm up instead of doing a standard traditional warm up. So go ahead and grab your weights and we're going to be holding that kettlebell right at our chest and starting with just a march. So a kettlebell right at our chest, marching it out. We have 15 per leg. This is six. Now the weight is not next to my body. I'm making my biceps work, right? I'm making my shoulders work a little bit. My core is engaged. I'm getting some lower abs. Three more. One, two, and three. Go ahead and bring your weight or your kettlebell straight down. We're going to just drop into a wide squat. Let's go. 15 of those. Again, you're warming up. So do this with weight, without weight. Totally up to you. That's eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and fifteen. Bringing that weight up to your chest. Our goal is to press out. Now, depending on how heavy your kettlebell is, you might not be able to press out, so I want you to press up, all right? So out or up, your choice. We have 15. Let's go. One, two, again, warming up. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, 13, 14, and 15. Let's go right back to the march. So holding that kettlebell at your chest, drive those knees up. One, two, three. I'm pulling the toe up. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15. Drop it down, spread those feet wide. Even though they're wide, they're not turned out. They're still pointing forward. Here we go, 15 of them. One, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and fifteen. Awesome. One more time through either that chest press or shoulder press. Let's go. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and fifteen. Beautiful. You should be feeling warm now. We're going to come down to a plank position. We're going to have our kettlebell on one side. From that plank position, you can either be here in that modified plank or up in a full plank. You're going to grab the kettlebell, move it to the other side. Keep switching back and forth. We have 15 per side, all right? I'm going to count out just once we've completed one on each side. Here we go. In three, in two, in one. Let's go. Modify where necessary. If you find that you're wobbling those hips around a lot, then you might need to drop to your knees. That's two, three, four, 
five, six, seven, eight. Keep going, you got it, nine. And 10, five more per side. 11, 12, 13, 14, last one. Finish all the way across and 15. Good job. Lay it down on your back. So, you've got your one weight or one kettlebell. Legs up in the air. We are going to do one chest press, one tricep skull crusher, one leg lift, all right? We then go two, two chest press, two tricep skull crushers, two leg lifts. We're working our way to 10, all right? So here we go, arms straight up, Legs straight up, let's go. One chest press, one tricep skull crusher, one leg lift, two chest press, two tricep skull crushers, two leg lifts. Now, if you're using a really heavy weight today, we're on to threes right now, you go as far as you can. I obviously don't want anyone to hurt themselves, so be mindful. Three, beautiful, moving on to fours, four chest presses, four tricep skull crushers, four leg lifts, two, three, and four, good, on to fives, three, four, five, skull crush, five, four, three, Two, one, leg lifts, five, four, three, two, one more. Beautiful, on to sixes. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Triceps, one, two, three, four, five, and six. On those leg lifts, if you're feeling it in your low back, you should shorten the distance in which you lower your legs or bend the knees. Beautiful. Sevens. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Triceps. One, two, three, four, five, six. And seven, good, seven leg lifts. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. On to eights, so we're so close to the end. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Triceps, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Good, eight leg lifts. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight, beautiful, nines, let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Triceps, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Ooh, I, was, I did 10, I did extra credit. One, two, three, four, 
Pull from those low abs. Five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Last one here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Ten triceps. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Hold it up strong for those ten leg lifts. One, two, three, four, five. Keep going. Six, seven, eight, nine. One more. And ten. Woo, good job. Grab a quick drink if you need it. A quick towel off. Quick drink, quick towel off. We are doing that whole set one more time. So that means we have the plank with the weight pole, 15 per side, and that chest press to tricep leg lift one more time. All right, remember, it's only a 30 minute workout. You can do this. You're thinking, oh my gosh, really don't want to do that again. It'll be over before you know it, all right? Here we go, straight arm plank with either knees on the ground or toes. Three, two, one, let's go. Pull it across. One, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, nine. You're so close. Keep going. Ten. Last five. Eleven. Twelve. Thirteen. 14, last one on each side, and 15, beautiful. Back on your back, the same exact thing. One press, one tricep, one leg lift, all the way to 10. Legs up in the air, here we go, in three, two, one, let's go. One press, one tricep, one leg lift, you got it, two. Just breathe. Two leg lifts. Threes. Three, good. One. Two. Three. Fours. Two. Three. Four, good. Four triceps. One. Two. Three. Four. Four leg lifts. The good news is we're only doing two sets of everything today. So you do not have to do this again. Whew, beautiful. Fives. One, two, three, four, five. Good. Five triceps. One, two, three, four, and five. Awesome. Five leg lifts. One, two, Remember, modify if you're feeling it in your low back. Three, four, and five. Halfway point, let's go. Two, three, four, five, and six. Six triceps. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Good. Don't worry about it if you're not keeping up at the same pace as me. You just do you, get through as much as you can, 
and join us when we move on to the next exercise. Beautiful. Sevens. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Good. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. The good thing about these workouts is you can always come back and do it again and see if you're able to keep pace, maybe use a heavier weight. Good job. Three more leg lifts. Nice. Eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Ooh, we're so close. Eight leg lifts. One, two, three, four, five. Good job. Six. Really get those low abs engaged. Seven and eight. Nine. So here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Good. One, two, three, four. You got it. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine leg lifts. One. This is where you could start feeling it in your back. Two. As your abs get tired, really focus three on those low abs. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. And nine. Here we go. Tens. Our very last set for today. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Ten triceps. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Good job. Ten leg lifts. One. Two. Three. Four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, last one, and ten. Good job. Towel off, grab some water, breathe for just a moment. We're going to stand up. We're going to an upright row. Lateral lunge with an upright row, I should say. So stand on up. Here we go. Holding your kettlebell. Take a nice wide stance. We're going to stay stationary lunge. We're going to drive over to the left. Upright row. Stand up. Over to the right. Upright row. Stand up. All right. So the reason we're doing it down in the lunge is because we're not going to use the energy from our legs when we're standing up to do it when we're at the top of, at the, top of the movement. We're going to force our upper body to have to do all the work when we're at the bottom of the movement. All right, so here we go. We're going to go 10 per side or 20 upright rows. Three, two, one, let's go. Elbows are high. Sit that booty back. That's one. Two. Now, if you're working with a really heavy weight, you might have to do your upright row at the top. Just because if you're not strong enough, I don't want you to hurt your back when you're down here in the lunge. That's five. Six. Make sure that knee is tracking towards the toe that your chest is upright. Seven. Eight. 
Nine, one more. And 10, awesome. All right, we're going to a single arm row from a lunge position. So we're gonna go left leg in front, right leg behind, holding our one kettlebell or weight in our right hand. You can go ahead and place your left hand on your knee and we are rowing up 15 times. Let's go. One, two, three, four. Keep your weight five in the heel of your left foot. Seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Beautiful, other side. Here we go. One, two, three, squeeze the shoulder blade. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Awesome. All right, we're back down to our mat for just a moment. We're gonna do sit up, Russian twist, back down. All right, we have 15 of those. Here we go. Sit up, Russian twist, that's one. Make sure you're keeping that kettlebell right in front of your chest. I don't want any extra strain on the spine. That's three. Want to make sure you're using your obliques. Four. Now, if a sit-up is not accessible to you, five. Some things you can do are extend your legs long. Six, that will make it easier. You can also just do a crunch with rotation. Seven. Eight. Nine. Good. Ten. Eleven. Twelve. Thirteen. Two more. Fourteen. Last one. And fifteen. Notice how I controlled my descent on every single one of those. You want to make sure that you're working through both the up and the down. All right, we're back to that nice wide lateral lunge, stationary lateral lunge with the upright row. 10 per side, we'll start going to the right this time in three, two, one, let's go. One, elbows are always above wrists. Two, three, make sure your booty is really far back, you're really sitting into that heel, four, five, six, seven, Eight. Good job. Nine. One more. Abs are engaged. Back is flat. And ten. Good job. Let's put left foot in front, or sorry, right foot in front, holding it with our left hand, starting on the other side this time. Getting into that lunge position and pull. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Five more. Check it with your right hand. Make sure you're not putting a ton of weight into that hand that's on the leg. Three more. Last one. Good. Other side. <clears throat> Here we go. In three, two, one. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Five more. One, two, three, four, and five. Taking it back down to your mat. <clears throat> Here we go. Sit up, brush and twist, controlling on the up and the down. Three, two, 
One, let's go. One. Two. Three. Challenge yourself to roll down one vertebra at a time. That's five. Six. Good. Seven. You're at the halfway point. That's eight. Nine. Ten. Eleven. Twelve. Three more. Thirteen. Fourteen. And fifteen. Good. Now I, pro I promised just a little bit of cardio, so here comes our very quick cardio set. We have 30 kettlebell or weight swings, followed by setting that weight down and 30 toe taps per foot. So we're going to have a nice flat back, butt goes back, we pop the hips forward in order to do this swing. Here we go, three, two, one, let's go. Pop the hips forward, that's one, two, three, four, five, flat back, six, seven, proud chest, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, finish strong, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, already halfway there, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, Squeeze the booty, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, and 30. Good, set your kettlebell or weight down, toe tops, 30 per foot. Here we go, three, two, one, let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. Whew. Hopefully that got your heart rate up a little bit. Again, if you need low to no impact, you can step that instead of hopping it. Here we go. Last round of each. Three, two, one. Let's go. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. We're halfway there. Sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. Make sure your abs are engaged. Twenty. 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. Awesome. All right. All that stands between us and being done are 30 toe taps. Here we go. Three, two, one. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty. 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. Good job, you guys. Thank you so much.